five. Locals know firsthand about the high cost of everything on the Strip, but this receipt really is raising some eyebrows. It's a $3 charge for rocks. 13 Action News reporter Tom George is live upstairs overlooking the Strip to explain. Tom. Yeah, well, Steve, a lot of locals say they stay away from the Strip because of all those costs, but this had people over the edge when it looked like they were being charged for ice. Well, turns out that may not be the case. It's the post that's gone viral, an upset customer from a bar at Bally's on the Strip showing a charge of three bucks for rocks. Many people sharing the picture thinking this was a new low, charging for ice. Well, after doing some research, turns out that's not the case. That's the overriding message. It has nothing to do with the ice. Most bars have an upcharge if a drink is on the rocks instead of with a mixer because you're actually consuming more alcohol. We're here at La Comita downtown, so there is a difference, right, Mari? He's going to show us. So if you had a mixed drink, it's actually yes. less. Actually, when you get a mixed drink, it's anything depending. It's like one and a half ounce. That's a shot glass. When you add or, add, order anything on the rocks, it's going to be two ounces. That's what you get. So you can see the extra charge is that half ounce you get. So that's what you're paying for. Exactly. But in this case, the charge isn't itemized on your receipt like it was here. When you do that and the bartender or server brings it in, they're actually charging you for that extra half ounce is right here is only two dollars, not three dollars, like on the strip. So why the outrage then? Expert Scott Robin with VitalVegas.com says lately, between room fees and parking fees, people are already suspicious of charges on the strip. I think the overall perception is people are ready to feel like they're being screwed, to feel like they're getting the short end of the stick. But this one has bartenders shaking their heads. A lot of things to complain about on the strip, but this is not. One this of is them. not one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Now we reached out to Caesars who owns Bally, Bally's about that receipt. They're still getting back to us.